Hi everybody, welcome back and today I will be unboxing Shizuo the Renewal figure and I'm really excited about this. I already kind of cut up some tape and stuff so I won't struggle too much. So uh, yeah, let's see how this goes. I'm really excited about this one because it's so pretty and I actually like that there's a lot of information on the altar figures when it comes to who paints it and all of that. So you can find that here. But it's not gonna focus so I'm sorry but it's done really really well and let's open this up oh I guess I can use this as a background then for she's wool which would be cool let's get it out oh it's just like wide outside okay never mind but this is still cool for displaying stuff, so I will put that back in the box. And there we go, because that's cool that they use it for that picture. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Oh, okay. So the face you can actually touch already. <laughs> There's like no plastic around that, which is fine. I don't mind that. Cool. Okay. Oh, that's weird. I actually thought that the glasses for Shizuo would be something extra, but it's actually two faces, one with the glasses and one without the glasses, which I think is interesting. And I will never get used to the fact of seeing Shizuo without glasses, so I will most likely put the glasses on. Uh, but I will probably change it now for you guys so you can see it. So I got the plastic off and then we have the stand or however you call it. It looks cool. I like it. Ooh, so that's that. And then we have the figure itself. And a Shizu. Cool. Okay. So I will have to remove uh, the plastic obviously, but this looks really really cool. This looks really nice. Okay, let's we'll try to get the head off. I'm always so scared doing this, especially with these pricey figures. Okay, that went smooth actually. I remember from my Hisoka figure, uh, I, was, I was so scared of breaking something. Man, that quality is so good. Oh, I'm really impressed. And actually, ooh, okay, that was smooth as well. <laughs> good. So his one arm is off and his head is off. So let's try out the other things that are with it. First is the other head. So I will try that now. And the other hand, which is this. Okay. That hand looks bigger than that one. Uh, it's probably just me imagining it, to be honest. But yeah, that is how it looks. Yeah. Okay. So the other stuff that I have with it is two cigarettes. I think in case if I lose one or something like that. And then... Ooh, plastic everywhere and then this which is pretty light I thought this would weigh a bit more but this is pretty light but it's probably good for when he's holding it so we have those two I need the other arm to put this in so first I'm gonna put him on his stand oh other way around Talia Good job. Okay. Alright, so that's that. Look how pretty he is. Okay, let's do the other thing. Let's try to get the cigarette um, between his fingers, I guess. But you can't really tell, but it's really, really thin between those two fingers. So 
Let's see, let's see. Okay, by looking at the cigarettes, I understand why. <laughs> wow, they're so tiny. I'm so glad there's two in here. So, my cat is here, so I guess ignore the meowing. <laughs> He's back out, he doesn't know what he wants. Anyways, what I was saying, look at the cigarettes. Like, it's super, super thin. You can barely see it. So... I'm pretty sure it will fit in between his fingers. So let's try this out. Ooh. Oh, this is so... It's, it's not difficult, it's just... You might lose this fairly quickly. Alright, I put it in between. You can't tell at all, a little bit right now. But yeah, it's... It's alright, it looks good. I will have to be careful to not lose the other one though, because it's so damn tiny. I didn't think it would be that small. But yeah, I will keep this safe. So let's go to the next thing, which is this. So obviously changing pose, I will remove the head and have the other arm so I can have like the traffic pole in there. So let's do the arm first. There we go. That's it's really good like how they do that Quality is so nice So this is supposed to it has to be that way If I'm not mistaken and then Not that way. I guess I don't should should I have put that in first probably not Ooh. Okay, okay I'm gonna get there This? I think it's like this? That takes up a lot of space though. Um, yeah. Yeah, that looks about right. So, as long as it's not hanging on the... Oof. On the base or anything like that, it's fine. Yeah. Okay, so that's that. And then change the head. And then it's perfect. This is the shizuo that I want. <laughs> I do have to admit, I do like the other pose and the other face, but this one is the Shizuo that I know from the anime and the Shizuo that I love. Crazy Shizuo that throws everything around. So, this is the final uh, look, I guess. And this is the way that I will probably keep him most of the times. So yeah, I'm really, really happy with it. It looks super good, I just kind of need to find a place to like show him off but I'll, I will find a place for him because he deserves it so yeah this is uh my unboxing of this figure i hope you enjoyed it give some love to shizuo and let me know what you think of the figure itself as well and i will see you soon thank you for watching bye